walking through Bhaktapur. We so the road down is a little car. bit scary. Uh, car with the Especially if it's muddy. Around, right? uh, the actual day for worshipping. Is that not the a road thing? is washed out. Of course, you can see how close we are to the yes. edge of the cliff. Okay. Oh, goats. So here's a cow. Of course, remember that cows are sacred, so they go wherever they want, do whatever they want. He said on the last trip two weeks ago, it had been a lot of rain and the tourists had to get out of the bus and actually push the bus at one point because it was sliding so bad. to go really slow in some spots to keep the bus from bottoming out. As you can see, it's really narrow, so watch how close we get to this bus. Yeah, we got a lot closer than that in some of them, some of the narrower parts. The road is about 16 kilometers long. It takes about an hour and a half to traverse and takes us up about 2,000 feet. I have to say the boat, uh, the bus tours have been the most interesting because uh, everything is so rich to watch. You don't want to go to sleep or miss anything. Coming to a little bitty village here, a hairpin turn here. Here's a wedding car. Another hairpin corner. It's actually drier now that we're coming down than what it was when we came up. It was really slippery when we came up. You don't want to slide around up here when you're a foot or two from the edge of the road. He said sometimes the bus does get stuck. Somebody has to come and pull it out. Okay, we've made it to town, so now we have all new problems with traffic. And <laughs> Narrow roads. He's carrying a goat on his motorcycle.